Greetings from EA Sports. I'm Brad Nessler, and alongside me are Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. And overcast skies on tap for tonight's game between the Virginia Cavaliers and the Seminoles of Florida State. Here come the Seminoles. The Cavaliers are coming into this game looking for the upset. What are your thoughts, sir? Florida State has so many weapons offensively, but it all starts with their outstanding quarterback. Now against this defense, I look for him to have no problem spreading the ball around. This could be a career day. All right, here you go, kid. I'm taking a note. All right, thanks, coach. Now let's take it down to the head referee at midfield for the coin toss. Brought to you by Coca-Cola. Both teams are on the field and we're just about ready to open things up. He sends it off. Right, has it at the five. The flag down, and I'm not sure when it was thrown. Let's find out. Clipping on the receiving team. So they'll move back after that costly penalty, and they'll have to try to get that yardage back here. Well, this quarterback is definitely the player to watch today, but he better watch out for these athletes on the defensive line. The key to this game is going to be the battle up front. If the offensive line can give this guy time to throw, he'll pick apart this defense. But if they let the pressure get to the quarterback, it could be a very long day for this offense. Yep, they'll be coming at him all day. And I think this kid will have a good game. He has a strong arm, good touch, and he's smart to pocket. That, my friend, is the complete quarterback. We'll see if they can get it in as they start this drive in the red zone. The Knolls line up in an eye formation. Cleveland hands it off. And they make the stop at the 10-yard line. They'll get two on that one. They'll line up on the 10. Florida State comes out with an eye formation. They hand it off. Touchdown, Florida State. Very impressive run by the halfback to find the end zone. Good play call here by the offensive coordinator who realizes when you get down into the red zone and you have a halfback like this, just give him the ball and let him find his way into the end zone. So the kicker's on the field to attempt the extra point. And he converts the extra point. With under five minutes remaining in the first quarter of play, the score, Florida State, seven. Virginia, nothing. Jefferson, ready to kick. He kicks it off. Austin takes from the 10. So now we'll get to see the offense come out of the field for their first drive of this game. They'll take the ball here. First and ten. The Knolls line up with six defensive backs. And he's taken down at the 32-yard line. Here's where the offense stands compared to the rest of the nation. And yeah, they sure are struggling when they have the ball. Nothing good seems to happen when they're on offense. Florida State comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Caught. He's taken down at the 37-yard line. First down there on a five-yard pass. This won't look like much on a stat sheet, but this play was executed to perfection. First, First and ten. ten. 
Ball on the 37 yard line. Virginia comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. And he takes a big hit at the 36. Loss of one there for the halfback. Florida State has one of the most rock-solid defenses in the country, guys. You just look at the stats, and these guys rank in the top ten in the country on defense. And they don't do anything too special, either. They just play hard-nosed defense, and it works. Over the middle. Got his man on the run. Chase with the tackle at the 40-yard line. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. First, First down. Ball on the 40-yard line. Virginia goes with the ace set here. First down, look at the throw. Dumps it, way to look it in. About six yards on that completion. From the 34-yard line, it's second and four. The Cavs are lining up with three receivers. Handoff up the middle. Sampson brings him down at the 34. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Third. They line up at the 34. Third down. One man backfield. Field sets up the play action. The ball is tipped. And he just beat the ball to the receiver's hands on that play. Nice deflection. Yep. And now it's fourth down. Four Looks down. like they're going to go for it on fourth down. Virginia sets up in the eye. Field hands it off. No, play fake. His receiver has it. Jones with a takedown at the 19-yard line. They just couldn't get to the quarterback in time. That's one of the things that can happen if the defense brings extra guys to rush the quarterback. The offense will have favorable matchups to get the ball downfield. And this kid is talented enough to see those receivers. It's not easy to get the ball past those big bulldozers when they're flying right at you. Might have been some early movement up front. That can be a move them back a bit. Yeah, with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. Shotgun set. Field set to go to the air. Let's it fly. Steven with the interception. And that's the second interception of the game by this defense. These guys are all over the field. It seems like wherever the quarterback throws the ball, there's a defender sitting right there. This drive will start at the three-yard line. Start the drive at the three-yard line. First and ten. The Seminole go with the I formation. Tackle made at the 13-yard line. Ten-yard pickup on the play. Second down and short. Ball on the 13. The Knolls line up in an I formation. 
The halfback with a carry. Tackle at the 18-yard line. So he picked up a few on that run. Yeah, he did a nice job of using his blockers on that run. Really a nice read. First down, 10 to go. First and 10. Ball on the 18-yard line. Sets up in the eye. Gives it up the gut. With the spin, he jukes. Lee with the tackle at the 30. He picked up big yardage on that run. Oh, this is great blocking up front. Nice job of holding on to their blocks, allowing him to break through for some big yards. It's first down. The Knolls go with the eye formation. Play action. He throws. And he got it. And he's all the way down to the 20-yard line. And, fellas, this is really turning into a very impressive drive. Three first downs and counting on this drive, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building some momentum here. And more importantly, they've kept this defense on the field. The pressure turns up when in the red zone. And that's when you turn to Old Spice red zone, when performance matters most. Virginia going with a three-man front. Holland again. So they'll lose some yards on that counterplay, guys. Yeah, there was no misdirection on the defense, that's for sure. These guys stayed in their lanes and made a very nice play. And we've come to the end of the first quarter with the score, Florida State 7, Virginia nothing. Virginia has a defense that, well, it's just plain bad. Have a look at the numbers. Now you're being kind, Brad. They can't stop anybody. They better start tackling better. It's going to be another long day. Looks, throws down the middle, and they make the stop at the two-yard line. The quarterback just rifled that one in there for a good game. And he's throwing the football with some pop, isn't he, Coach? Hey, if he's not careful, he's going to break his receiver's finger. Florida State hoping to go up two touchdowns here. Let's see if they can get it in for the touchdown. Option. And it pays off. Touchdown. No need to pitch it as the quarterback's able to run it in. I'll tell you what, when your quarterback in the blue line is right there, it's pretty hard to pitch the ball when you think you can get in. It's a smart decision to keep it from the score. They'll line up for the extra point. And he adds the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Florida State to kick right. And Austin back deep to return. He sends it off. Austin takes it from the six. Broke away from one. So the offense will come out and try to turn things around after an interception on their last drive. The quarterback has to get that interception out of his head. He can't be scared to keep firing away in this game or the defense will tear you apart. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers brought to you by Cope. The cab set up in the gun. The running back has it. Chase with a takedown at the 33. And the tailback picks up great yardage on the run. How many times did we see him run that play in practice this oh, week? A thousand times. And it was just as successful then as it is right now. First it's ten. first and ten. Ball, Ball on the 33 yard line. Yard. Virginia comes to the line with three wide. Brought down at the 36-yard line. Smith gets three yards on the carry. That'll bring up second down. Second, second down, seven, seven yards ball to go. Ball on the 36. The Cavs come out showing three wide. Field with a nice play fake. Lilly will make the sack. their own 
29 yard line. Third and 14 coming up here. Virginia comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Field, back to pass, lets it fly, and this one falls incomplete. He overthrew the receiver. Virginia, ready to put this one away. Holland is back deep to return the punt. He gets it off. Holland fields it at the 37. The offense with a lot of success through the air on that last drive as they moved it down the field for the touchdown. We'll see if they can capitalize on their good field the position. At the 41-yard line. First and ten. This defense is in the dime. Cleveland drops to throw. Cleveland unloads. In and out of his hand. Thomas was the intended target on the play. So that'll make it second down. Second, second down and ten to go. On the 41-yard line. Yard line. Holland is the single setback. Holland takes the pitch. Gets past the tackler. The tackle at the 20. And the halfback rips off a nice game there to get him the first. Hey, this kid's a good looking back. Let's see if they go to him again. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 20. Three-man front defensively. Missed tackle. Touchdown, Florida State. Kirk, that was his second touchdown of the day. What else can we expect from him? Well, I'd bet on at least a couple more touchdowns for starters. He looks like he's really come to play here in the first half. Here's the try for the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. So under three minutes to go in the second quarter. And the score, Florida State, 21. Virginia, nothing. Florida State lines up for the kickoff. Right and Boston set to return. Kicks it off. Boston fields it at the three. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. Here are the offensive production staff, brought to you today by Coca-Cola. There was some movement on the line. A lack of concentration will push the offense back. Yep, the kid was in a hurry to block someone. You gotta control that. with a single setback to you. Field will hand it off. Smith gains seven yards on that play. Seven Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 24-yard line. The Cavaliers come out showing three wide. On play action. Throws it to the outside. And it falls incomplete. Not much you can do there, Coach. Nope. Not much at all. It's not easy hanging on to the football when there's another guy coming at you. Those are going to be drops more times than not. It's third down and eight to go. Ball in 24. They'll bring in their dime package. Stepping up. Throws it. Got it. 
Great play to keep his feet in and get the first down. It takes tremendous concentration and field awareness to make a play like that. And the quarterback put it in a place where only his receiver could catch it. Nice throw. it go. It's complete. Gain of nine. Second, Second and short. Ball on the 37 yard line. Field comes to the line with three wide. Moves up in the pocket. Field goes down with a sack. Lining up with three receivers. Field drops to throw. Over the middle. Batted ball. Now that's the way to get in there and break up the pass. And more importantly, Coach, brings up a fourth down situation. The Cavaliers line up the punt. Anderson is waiting for the snap. He gets it away, and it's a skyrocket. Signals for a fair catch. They get the ball back after a touchdown on their last possession. And the reason why they scored last time was because of the way they ran the football. Yeah, you're right, Lee. They drove almost the length of the field. Let's see if they can put some more points up on the board. Florida State comes to the line with three wide. The halfback couldn't get any running room. And that was because the defense had called a blitz just at the right time. They went right through the offensive line and nailed them for a long time. Second and ten. 13 yard line. Cleveland with three wide receivers. He drops back. Looking. Rolling out to the right side. Incomplete pass. Incomplete not a pretty pass. pass right there. No, it wasn't, Kirk. That was not a good pass at all. But hey, in his defense, he third had to get it off 10. to avoid the sack. Ball on the 13 yard We've line. got third and ten. Ball on their own 13. Holland, the lone back. He's looking to pass. Looks. He's looking down the middle. His receiver has it. He's tackled at the 35-yard line. Boy, did he zip that ball in there. Yeah, you're right. There's not a whole lot of quarterbacks out there that can make this throw. He delivers this one right where it has to be. Great arm strength. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics. Brought to you by Coke. Holland lines up as a single back. Holland on a counter. Lee tackles him at midfield. And he comes up with a nice run. A nice run, but they kept him from getting out of bounds and stopping the clock. First, First down, 10. 10 to go on the 50-yard line. Holland, the lone back. Cleveland, back to pass. He rolls out to the right. He's going to take off. He's knocked out of bounds at the 45-yard line. Cleveland, he appears to have been injured on the play. Second it's second down and five to go. Ball, Ball on the 45-yard line. Florida State lines up with three receivers. Drops back to pass. Looks. Rifles it over the middle. Another catch. So they go to the air and they pick up yet another first down. They've shown no problems moving the ball on this drive. This offense is moving the ball very well. And they're building some beautiful momentum 
along the way. It's first down. Virginia lines up defensively in a 3-4. They go with a run. Kane with a takedown at the 18. So they keep him in the field of play, guys. Yeah, good pick up here on the ground, but I bet the coach would have been happier if he was able to get out of bounds on that play to stop the clock. Remember, the clock stops to move the chains, but it'll stop again once they are set. So they have to hurry up. Hands it off. He spins. Fake to move. They'll bring him down at the four. And he just eclipsed the 1,000-yard mark for rushing. You know, to a lot of people, it's no big deal if a guy runs for over 1,000 yards in a season. But I'll tell you what, it takes some skills to be able to accomplish this feat. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. The Seminoles call for a timeout. That was their second timeout. Second and goal. About a yard to Pater. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Thomas gives it up the middle. Simmons with the tackle at the one-yard line. The Seminoles take a timeout, and now they got no timeouts left. Kick is up, and it is good. And here's the Pontiac drive summer. Florida State to kick. He boots it deep downfield. Austin fields it in the end zone. The offense comes back on the field, hoping to build off their last drive. It's all about execution, my friends. We saw them move the football, but they were unable to move it when it mattered most. But Lee, I think you have to give credit to this defense. They tightened up when they had to, and they're going to look to do the same here. Virginia will line up in a jumbo set here. Tackle made at the 23. We still have a half left to play, but right now, they've got this thing under control. Our score, Florida State, 24. Virginia, nothing. The teams are lined up and we're just about ready to start this second half. And this one's a short kick. Hawkins takes it at the 12. And now we'll see the offense come out out of the field for their next possession. They'll, They'll go to work with the 26 yard line. Yard line. The Knoll first go with the I formation. Thomas hands it off. He's taken down at the 41. And that one goes for a big, big first down. You know, every time you run the ball successfully like that, that defense starts to creep up a little bit. That's when you go to the air, my friend. Over the top. From their own 41-yard line, it's first down. The Seminole line up in an I formation. Thomas hands it off straight ahead. Broke away from one. And he's level at the 48-yard line. And he reeled off a big one there. This offensive line is built to allow this tailback to make plays, as you just saw. He's able to get into the open and create some excitement right there. First down. The Knolls go with the I formation. They give to the tailback, and they got him for a loss. Well, the defense really put the clamps down on that run. Boy, Brad, great effort up front by that defense. 
second it's second down 13. now, 13 to go. Ball, Ball on the road going on. The Seminole line up in an eye formation. Holland on the inside handoff. Good open field tackle. And that's their third first down of the drive. Great blocking and great running equals. Very successful offense. And they've looked really good on this drive, Coach. The defense needs to figure out a way to stop them, or else they're going to have no problem putting points on the board. First, First and ten. ten. Ball, Ball on the 36-yard line. Yard line. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Give to the tailback. He's tackled at the 30. About six yards on the play. Second it's four. second and four to go. Virginia brings in the nickel here. Gets past the tackler. Little shake and bake move. Still on his feet. They'll bring him down at the 14-yard line. He picked up big yardage on that run. Oh, this is great blocking up front. Nice job of holding on to their blocks, allowing him to break through for some big yards. Pressure turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. And he takes a big hit at the 15. Drop back a yard. Here's the eighth play of the series. Ball on the 15 yard line. Florida State sets up in the eye. Holland on the give. Neal tackles him for a loss on the play. Two-yard loss for the halfback. Florida State. Rarely comes away empty-handed once they get into the red zone. Brad, they have one of the best red zone percentages in the country. I'd be surprised if they didn't get some points on the board here as well. Handoff up the middle. Can't wrap him up. Sharp tackles him at the 13. He carries the ball for three, maybe four yards. Fourth down. This kick will be from about 30 yards out. It's up, and he got it. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive center. Jefferson looks ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. Right from his own end zone. Once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. The, the offense will take over the 17 yard line. 17 yard line. First and 10. Virginia comes out with an eye formation. Field hands it off. He spins around. Tackle made at the 23. Smith gets six yards on the play. Second, Second and four. Ball on the 23-yard line. He drops back. He delivers. 
What a pick. The 10. And down he goes at the 6. What is going on here, guys? They've just been outplayed and outcoached out there. Anything and everything is going on today, Kirk. There's not much else you can do except pack it up and try again next week. They'll go to work at the six-yard line. The Cavs come out in a 34 defense. Holland gets it on the inside. Foster with the tackle at the three-yard line. Just about three yards there. As we go to the final quarter of play, this one is almost wrapped up. Our score here, Florida State 27, Virginia nothing. Second We've got and second and goal. Three yards for the touchdown. They're in the eye. Thomas pitches out to the left. Touchdown, FSU! And that's his third score on the ground today. Boy, this guy's been huge today. It's been a big part of the reason that his team has the lead. Well, you have to have faith in your running back, Kirk. And you're right, this kid is a big reason why this offense has been very successful today. Here's the kicking team to try the extra point. He makes the PAT. So with under five minutes to go here in the fourth, the score, Florida State 34, Virginia nothing. Florida State is ready to kick it away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. Austin fields it in the end zone. They've been getting walloped all day, but at least they're still working hard. I like a team that never quits. The, the offense will start at the 22. At the 22 yard line. First and 10. They line up with split backs. Field hands off on the delay. Davis with a takedown at the 27. They get five yards on the play. Second it's second five. down. The Cavs go with the eye formation. Smith crosses it. And the offense will recover. They dodged a bullet right there, guys. Boy, did they. That halfback has got to keep both hands on the football. Coaches hate it when the running backs fumble the football. They are supposed to have the best hands on the football team. The Cavalier come out in a shotgun. Steps up. He's in trouble. Sampson comes away with a sack. Good play by the defense. Yeah, they came with the blitz that time, and the big lineman was able to spring free for the sack. The Cavaliers are lining up to punt it away. Anderson awaits the snap. Punts the ball away. Holland fields it at the 50. Down the sideline to the 10. Touchdown, Florida State. Where was the coverage on that play? Well, credit to blocking here. They created a big enough lane for him to run through. And as they say, the rest is history. And he hits the PAT. So with less than four minutes to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, Florida State, 41, Virginia, nothing. Florida State lines up for the kickoff. Decent kick. Austin from his own end zone. You know who's trembling right now? 
not the defense. They played well all game. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coca-Cola. Virginia lines up in a pro set. Smith on a pitch out. Ingram hits him in the back here. Look at that. The Blitz just threw off their blocking assignments. And that's why this running back is looking for his mouthpiece right now. They line up at the 22. It's second down. Four wide receivers in the formation. Field drops back. He passes it. Complete. He ignores the footsteps and makes the catch. And he got stopped before he even got started on that thing. That defense had to rise on that kid the entire time. Whoa. From their own 25-yard line. It's third down and 11 to go. The can come out in the ace formation. Field goes with a play fake. He snags it. He's tackled at the 32. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Well, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. Holland back to return, and he's already proven he can break these with a block or two. He gets it off. Holland fields it at the 35. Down the sideline. To the 20. To the 10. And they're going to bring this one all the way back. Touchdown. How about that play? Woo, what an incredible display of athleticism and balance. The ability to turn something out of nothing. And they line up for the point after. Splits the uprights for the extra point. So with just over two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter, our score, Florida State, 48, Virginia, nothing. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off. Higdon from his own end zone. Guys, what do you think about this situation? Hopefully, we'll see the offense move this ball up the field a little bit. Yeah, Coach, they really haven't had too much success today. But this is an opportunity for them to get their team back on track and build some confidence going into the next game. The Cavs go with the eye formation. Williams on play action. Has his fullback. And he's taken down at the 41. You know, it's really easy to overlook those guys on the line. Yeah, the defense came after them, first and those down. linemen held them long enough for the quarterback to throw for a first down. They line up in an eye. Williams on first down. He unloads it. Complete. He's taken down at the 46. Nice little pattern there. Yeah, he had great position there, and that ball was thrown in the right spot. We've got a second and five. The Cavalier come out showing three wide. And they got him. It's third and nine. Ball on their own 42. The Cavs come out in the ace formation. It's deflected. Good defensive play. Makes it fourth down. I'm sending out a big yo to the defensive coordinator right there. I'm sure he appreciates that yo. Great job of mixing up the coverage and putting his players in a spot to make a play. And they're smart enough to know the situation and to just knock it down. Holland has been explosive so far, returning two of these for touchdown. He gets it away. Holland fields it at the 24. The 50 at the point. At the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, Seminole. He made it look easy there, guys. Yeah, we saw the same things all week in practice, Brad. He makes it look so easy out there. No question, Coach. Whenever he touches the football, you just know something special is going to happen. So the kicker's on the field to attempt the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. So it's just over a minute to go here in the fourth quarter. Our score, Florida State, 55, Virginia, nothing. Florida State ready to kick this one off.
He sends it off. Higdon takes it from the six. They're just about ready to get this drive started. After their last series had some promise, but it ended with a punt. The Virginia Cavaliers will start the drive at the 25-yard line. First and ten. Virginia comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Clark runs a counter, and he hits him hard at the 26-yard line. Florida State will take their first time out of the half. From their own 26-yard line, second down and nine to go. Williams comes to the line with three wide. He'll dump it short, and it's caught, and he's leveled. What a hit. A decent gain on the pass. Yo, Kirk, good job by the quarterback here reading this play. First yeah, the defense ten. came with a blitz, and you're right. Great job by this young quarterback of recognizing the coverage and spotting the open man. Virginia goes with the ace set here. Williams off the fake, and it's incomplete. incomplete. The quarterback had a tough time with a blitz on that one. Uh, with this guy, you can't let him stand back there and have too much time to throw the ball. You've got to get a hand in his face. Virginia comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He's looking to pass. He's looking for his man. That's a great tackle at the 40-yard line. That screen didn't go very well. But I'll tell you, the defense knew that play from the get-go. That's called knowing the scouting report and knowing the tendencies of the offense. They line up at the 40. Third and eight yard line. Virginia goes with the ace set here. Drops back to pass. Williams throws it out there. It's complete. And down he goes at the 47-yard line. That's how you convert third down, sweetheart. That was a good-looking play, wasn't it, Coach? Oh, yeah, this offensive coordinator must have seen something in the defense he really liked. Looks like someone went a little too far with the celebration. Unsportsmanlike conduct on the offense. 15 yards first down. First, first down. Ball on the 38-yard line. Virginia lines up in a shotgun set. Setting up play action. Waits till the last moment. Boy, would he like to have that one back. Yeah, you're right. This offense relies so much on timing. And as you saw there, when their timing gets knocked off, they have a tough time connecting on plays like this. Williams tosses it left. Steven tackles him behind the line for a loss on the play. Great pursuit by the defense to stop the outside run. Yeah, the halfback was trying to get to the corner, but he had no luck at all. Bro. It's a done deal here as the final whistle blows. Kirk, any final thoughts here? Go ahead, Brad. Just an absolutely ugly offensive performance. Virginia was completely dominated by this overpowering defense. They couldn't pass, they couldn't run, and most importantly, they couldn't score. Brad, they were simply overmatched. We look forward to calling more games of NCAA football 2007. But until then, our final score in this one, Florida State 55, Virginia nothing.